The Honourable Member for Lavra Andre. Go ahead. Dave. Thank you, Madam Speaker. I'm pleased to take this opportunity to ex extend my sincere congratulations to the members and coaching staff of the Ross L. Gray School Basketball Program. This little school with a big heart ensures that they remain a provincial leader in varsity girls and varsity boys A basketball. This year, the Manitoba High School Athletic Association single A provincials in Vita and Elm Creek, the varsity girls team led by coach Daryl Peterson and assistant coach Ainsley Peterson won the provincial varsity girls A basketball championship for the second year in a row. Mr. Peterson received the Single A Coach of the Year Award last year, and Caitlin Thiessen was named the MVP of this year's Provincials. She, al she was also named to the second team All-Manitoba team at this year's graduating All-Star Banquet. Ross L. Gray School has 141 students enrolled, with only 38 enrolled in grade 9 to 12, making it one of the smallest high schools in the province. The school has only four girls that are eligible to play varsity, junior varsity, but you need five to make a team. Therefore, these girls played with the junior varsity boys team as well as the varsity team. The varsity boys had a very successful year as well. After winning three consecutive championships, they earned a silver medal for the last two years. They are led by coach Robert Stradeski and assistant coach Keith Prito. Mr. Stradeski was named the single A coach of the year for varsity boys basketball this year, and Jordan Hebel re represented Ross L. Gray School at the annual graduating A AAA All-Star Game that was held in Winnipeg this spring, which was also coached by Mr. Stradeski. Jordan was also named a member of the first team All-Manitoba team. Madam Speaker, the hard work and dedication of the players, coaches, staff, and parents is why the Ross L. Gray Raiders have been so successful. On behalf of myself and all my constituents in Leverandre, I would like to congratulate the Raiders on their second straight championship and outstanding accomplishments. I look forward to seeing them capture their third straight title in 2017. Thank you. I ask for leave to have the names of the boys and girls teams put in answer.